Hey there, true believers. Drink is Rocky with more. Let's play Rune Factory. The last time we made some more monies, and now we're probably gonna make some more monies. I know, right? Almost like I'm grinding something else now instead of grinding wood. Haha. <laughs> anyway, uh, between videos, we're gonna take a bath. We're not gonna do that between videos. We're gonna do that right now. Um, between videos, I played some more uh, uh, Brave with Default. Mostly been working on. Uh, we're building the town, <clears throat> since that's one of the it's one of the mechanics in the game. You can rebuild a town that lets you get uh, special stuff and junk. It's pretty good, not gonna lie. It's a fun little mechanic. It's a good thing that I can still like do something while I'm at work, basically. That's the uh, the point of it. So it's it's quite good for that. But I did that, and <clears throat> sorry. I'm a little bit, a little bit coldy still. You'll have to pardon my occasional throat clears. I'll try to do them off, off camera, off mic, but they will happen unfortunately. But I played more of that, and I got the salve maker and the sword master um, asterisks, almost like dress spheres for some reason. Not entirely sure, but I, I did almost say dress sphere, and that would have been embarrassing. But um, I got those, and um, uh, I like the Sword Master. It's pretty fun. Uh, I didn't use the Salve Maker. I looked at its abilities, and I said, Neh. I said largely this is not a thing that interests me, so I didn't even bother. <coughs> so yes. Uh, but Sword Master is fun. Uh, its its whole gimmick relies around uh, predict predicting your opponent's attacks and throwing up ironclad defenses to negate their attack and counterattack for massive damage. It's pretty cool. And the actual boss fight for the Asterisk was, was pretty cool as well. You had to uh, fight the fight al the way that he wants to fight. You didn't get control. Like, my usual boss strategy, not gonna lie here, is to default. I build up extra, extra turns until I have the maximum number of turns. Then throw out, like, insane combos of, oh, this is your special attack that raises up magic damage for, the, for, the, for a while. And then spamming a bunch of magic abilities. Or, oh, we're gonna raise our crit rate and then hit normally a whole bunch of times. Or whatever. It's <clears throat> pretty rudimentary combo system that I'm exploiting, or using as, as intended, you can judge how- we got a lot of those today, my god. We may actually have enough soon. Like, money-wise, we might actually have enough soon. Where's my sword? Why my sword and my hammer closer? Oh, I don't know. But, the- the- the, the fight against the Swordmaster, you have to actually, uh, sort of predict how he's going to fight in reaction to how you're fighting. It's kind of weird to explain. But he'll throw um, his abilities, uh, Nothing Ventured, I think is one of them, and Before Swan. Uh, what they do is, respectively, I don't know which one exactly does which, but they'll be, um, they'll, they'll, uh, reduce the damage and counter-attack physical attacks or magic attacks. And then you just have to basically let someone die. I haven't found, I don't know a way to prevent them from dying. <clears throat> With the sheer strength of, uh, of, of his counter-attacks. I really don't know how you can just not die from that, but... I'm assuming it's possible somehow, right? It has to be somehow possible. But you, uh, you sacrifice somebody, he, uh, have everybody defend, he throws a thousand more attacks at you, and then he's just down for a while. Then you revive, you heal, and then you wail on him for the rest of the turns, and then you repeat over and over and over. Up till the end, where he just goes apeshit the whole time. So it, uh, it, it was a fun little fight. I liked it. I liked uh, having to think about how to, how to handle situations. I probably did, did the fight all wrong, too, because that's generally how, how I do things. Wrong. Uh, it was fun. It was fun. It was a fun fight. I liked it. Then the salve maker was, was 
a BS boss fight. <laughs> um, <clears throat> you uh, you fight him, and what he what his big thing is, he throw hello diamond. He throws poisonous high potions at you that deal a lot of flat damage. You can't uh, prevent it or reduce it, which sucks. Um, another earlier boss in the game did that same kind of thing, and it was absolute shit then, too. But, uh, yeah, it's not any different this time. Um, but he does, uh, he'll throw, he would, he would throw the guaranteed 1,000 damage and poison, and then he would just kind of chill out for a while, and he would cast regenerate on himself. He's, he was, he was a pain in the ass. He wasn't even fun. At least the Swordmaster was fun. Self Maker was not fun. It was a boring, lame, frustrating boss battle. At least the Profiteer uh, earlier on the uh, is, is, what's that class called? The um, I don't remember. I don't remember what the class is called. But it's it's a it's a money based class. It is like throw coin <coughs> and stuff like that. It's it's not it's not a class I'm using. It's it's I can see it being good for grinding, but for progress I would hesitate. But uh, he he did an attack similar to that also. It was way back at the beginning of the game, so it wasn't a thousand damage; it was three hundred, which was still oh my god diamonds. Look at your rocks. Your rocks are now diamonds. Beautiful. The game itself wants me to uh, get this house upgraded. It's telling me this right now. That it's just giving me diamonds and rubies galore. Don't worry, game. Soon we'll be able to get our house our, our house extension. <clears throat> Maybe even after all this after all this sells, which won't be until tomorrow. So hopefully it's enough. Yeah, th this is our last trip. Don't worry. We should be more than fine after this, to be honest with you. Just with oh my god. Let's see. We have nine, so that's. 9 times 7, that's 63. And we have 3 diamonds, which are about 1,000 each, so that's another 3,000. So we're at... <clears throat> what? Um, 7... No, we're at 9-something. So, 9-something plus whatever else I grow. I mean, we should be close to 15. Should be, at least. And then we can go and do all the things. Yay! All the things being done. And by all the things, I mean exclusively leveling up our house. Oh, we need to save, too. Avoid that, uh... Avoid that problematic storm weather. Sweet. No storm. I've been lucky with that uh, since I learned how to how to avoid it. We've been getting very lucky with that. Oh, there's a festival today, isn't there? Oh, I didn't want that. Oopsies. Oh, buttons. I'm confused by buttons. I blame the long day and the cold <clears throat> for my inability to button. Today's a festival day, too, isn't it? Yeah, it's, uh... Milk... Milk Day. Or whatever. Good old Milk Day. Oh, Out of water. We, we, we can just go say hi to everybody. We're not gonna participate in the festival, but, uh... We don't have anyone, any way to get milk except for kill Buffamoo over and over, which is boring. I'm trying to avoid grinding swordsmanship any in in the in the on screen. That's the way I can say that. <clears throat> I'm trying to avoid doing that, but I feel I may have to once we get to the next cave because uh, simply everything there is worth a lot of EXP, and we need a lot of EXP. So. Should be a higher a higher level by now, ideally. But I don't want to go grind swordsmanship, so we're not. And it's better once we get to this game anyway, so it all works out. 
So let's see, I've babbled about Bravely Default for a while now. And I've coughed a lot. Which is, I'm so, which I'm very sorry for, by the way, but... That explained I have a, a, bit of a, a bit of a cold. I'm trying to not cough a whole lot, but... We all hear how that's working, eh? Yeah, let's water the farm crops, and then we can go to the festival. I may just go to bed after that, to be honest with you, because I don't... I don't know if I want to put a lot of effort into in today. So we may just, uh, go take a nap and call it a day. Perfect. And it's only 8.20, though. I think it's also a little too early for, uh, festival time, so we'll water our, uh, our cave stuff. Oh, wow. Eggplants are already grown a little bit. Neat. Eggplant, eggplant. I don't like eggplant in real life. I, uh, I'm not a fan. Uh, peop uh, peop 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 people in my family swear by it, and, uh, it's really not that good. I don't think so, at least. If you like eggplant, that's fine, but I, I don't care for it. I just want something to start growing. That's, that's all that I want. We don't, we don't need to uh, level up these eggplants. I'm happy with them being level one. We're only using them to get one thing, and then that'll be the end of that. Do this, and then we'll go back into town. And we'll talk to everybody and say hi on the festival. Everybody should be out now, right? We have no milk to bring, Parumpa Pum Pum. So we're just gonna have to deal with uh, saying hi. Oh, everybody is out. That's very true. Leo's a sensible dwarf. Not a dwarf. He's a basically dwarf. Oh, act as intolerant then. Very well. Alright. Cool story. You're probably gonna win compared to me, Camus. Just gonna put that out there. Could you be any more nervous, Tori? Hmm. It's a very good question. Good morning. Yeah, 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 yeah Emmett. Th thanks for that. Lots of alcohol uses milk. Kids can't drink alcohol. Hey, thanks, Emmett. Truly a m truly a master. Probably shouldn't do that, Jasper. Just we should not drink gallons of milk. Fair enough. Well, that's what everyone's doing doing, doing on festival day. Now, time to go do what we're gonna do on festival day. Slay monsters and water turnips. Yeah! <clears throat> well, uh, radishes. So, there. And apparently I'm, I'm allowed to give uh, uh, a 
allowed to give um, Felicity a cough, a cold medicine, which I could use a little bit of, to be honest with you. But I'll do that after the video. Um, oh, I gotta buy Greenifier before. Mm, yeah, I gotta buy Greenifier. Or did I do that already? I don't remember. It's been a while since I. <laughs> it's been been a while, okay. I don't play this every day. It's been about a week. Actually, let me go find out real quick if I if I put Green of Fire down or not. I'll be able to find that in the, uh, the the last couple videos. So, give me one second, everybody. All right, we're back. Yes, I did use Green of Fire. It was the very last thing that I did. The very, very, very last thing I did. So, perfect. Just go ahead and water this and not even feel a bit afraid. Perfect. Yeah, I, I forgot legitimately if I did that or not. And I'm glad that I remembered because I wouldn't have remembered this time. So we just gotta wait till those grow now and then we can get level 3 strawberries. Ooh. Level 3 strawberries. Perfect. Then from there we can work on the next level and so on and so on have consistent money intake for the rest of the series. Hopefully. Speaking of, I need to buy a lot of other things once we get the house upgraded. There's a lot more things I need money for. Like watering can misses. I'm flogging myself whenever I do that, by the way. No, not really. I'm not actually doing that. That'd be awful. I'd be dead, I'd be dead by the end of, the end of this episode. Anyway, though, let's go check on our, our our active strawberries and see what we got there. And we'll uh, carry on to the night. Oh, perfect. Perfect. Beautiful. Oh, should we mine more? That's a realistic question I need to ask myself. Because um, we can mine a bit more today and have a much better chance of we could just mine tomorrow and not waste it today. Because I think we're going to have enough. Oh, uh, it's tricky. It's tricky. Oh, but if I have a good mine... I, sh I should mine now. Yeah, I, I should mine now. Now and tomorrow. That way I can just uh, double up my, my chances. Let me just take that one. That one's mine. Until we get home. Uh... <laughs> Double up my chances of having enough money because I really want to finish this money like soon, and then we'll work on other things from there, such as upgrading all of my gear, which is going to be a video in and of itself. I'm going to spend a whole video just, uh, just leveling up my crap. So don't worry though, we'll be a lot better after. It'll it'll be it'll be for the better in the grand scheme. I better fix my headset. Because I am being consciously aware of where it is now. I'm trying to actively not have a, an inconsistent volume situation with my voice. I think the game is fine, it's just my audio, just my audio needs to be uh, <clears throat> policed a little better. But I'm working on it. I, I am. I'm, I'm, I'm listening, to some, listening, listening to suggestions, and I am trying to better myself a little bit. But only a little bit. So let's see. If we have 12 ish from just the, the stones we had. So it'll be 12 ish. We'll be about halfway then. So when I finish these strawberries, where are we, we going to have then? Covered a gamut of, uh, com of conversation topics today. We did our, our Bravely Default status update. We did accounting. <laughs> it's great. Let's see, I have two, four, that's 36 strawberries. I have 200 a thing. So 36 times 200, times 200. That's 70, it's 7,200. So with what we have before, we're at 19. Okay, so I will need to go mine a little bit tonight, just to um, 
put a little, put a bigger dent in a more likely outcome of us getting what I want to happen. That's all of them, I think. Yeah, that's all of them. Okay. Well, anyway, hope you guys had fun, and I will see you next time with the most Rune Factory, where we will go back to the mines and do more mining because mining is the thing that we must do. We must mine in the mine because mining, etc. So, till then, till then. Okay.